Hi, good afternoon. My name is Dr. Manjit Jund. I'm the Chief Executive of Whips Cross Hospital. I'm absolutely delighted to be standing here today in front of our brand new surgical robot. This is our first ever surgical robot here at Whips Cross Hospital, where we are now a centre for robotic surgery. And that's going to be absolutely transformational for our community. It's going to allow us to provide new types of treatment. It's going to let patients recover faster with less complications. And it's going to eliminate the postcode lottery of treatment that too many of our residents have been seeing. We're incredibly excited about this, but we've only been able to make this happen by not just working together here at Whips Cross, but with our colleagues across the Barts group and particularly the Barts charity who've made this happen today with a really generous multi-million pound grant in order for us to be able to buy this robot. This is a real landmark moment for our community and I hope you'll join us in celebrating it. Thank you very much and we'll see you all soon. So my name is Fuleo De Jimmy. I'm a consultant gynaecologist uh, here at Whips Cross. So excited about the arrival of our new Da Vinci robot. So, my, so the robotic, ro the robot in itself is just a tool. So most surgeons are experienced as what they do as it stands at the minute, and what the robot does is actually add that finesse to surgery. So you see better. It's up close. It's in 3D and you get these seven degrees of motion because the, the human wrist can only move so far. The robotic wrist is able to go into places that the human can't see and that actually makes the robot a, a safer. It makes it more articulate and you get better outcomes from surgery. This, this here is where the surgeon sits. So the surgeon sits and this can actually be quite remote from where the robot is. Now the arms of the robot haven't yet been attached, but these are the bits that actually go into the patient. You see here, this is what would happen at laparoscopic surgery. Then happens, the surgeon sits at the console, um, articulates themselves and actually sees in 3D what's actually happening. So from the gynecological point of view, uh, usually for the hysterectomies, it's actually been shown to be quite efficacious. And the one thing that we intend to do here at WHIPS in particular is for our patients who have fibroids, who previously would have had open surgery, would then be able to benefit from the advantages of, 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 of robotic surgery. It's been a long time coming, and I'm pretty sure that our patients will benefit maximally um, from uh, the, the introduction of robotic surgery to an already enthusiastic team here at WHIPS Cross. So thanks everyone, and we look forward to, to coming back to everybody with the result, results of, of the surgery that we're about to undertake.